made it into the 70s today. We just didn't have the sun. We've been dealing with off and on uh, rain, a few thunderstorms. We're going to get you caught up on live Doppler 13 radar. I do want to highlight those counties across the southeastern part of the state under a tornado watch technically until 9 p.m. Uh, the greater severe threat is now across parts of Ohio, but we're going to watch all of the storms closely on live Doppler 13 radar. No lightning here, but Bloomington, you've got some heavy rain overhead just east of Ellisville. And then as we travel north to just south of Martinsville, some spotty showers just west of you, Franklin and Trafalgar, a little bit of rain Southport into uh, Greenwood, and then some heavier pockets of rain developing just to the west of Morristown and over Greenfield, still raining on the east side near Lawrence around Pendleton Pike. Speaking of Pendleton, we go up to Pendleton Anderson, moving into Alexandria, back through Elwood, and then another area of some steady rain, Kempton to Kirkland, just west of Sheridan. So we'll be in and out of some showers, maybe a couple of thunderstorms yet this evening. Should end by 7, 8, 9 o'clock. For most of us, we've got a cloudy day on tap for tomorrow, and no, not 73, but we'll be in the low to mid 60s for highs starting the day at 50, 56 midday, and again in the 60s. As we get into Thursday, Thursday will start dry. Maybe a couple peaks of sunshine, but it's going to end with a chance of more rain. That's what we're timing with a big view of future track 13. We'll pick this up Thursday afternoon at four o'clock. A lot of Thursday, at least during the daytime hours, will be dry with the steadier rain arriving Thursday night into Friday. That was 11 p.m. This is Friday, 8 a.m. Friday looks to be an indoor day for a good part of central Indiana. This rain looks to be heavy at times. That's midday on Friday. We'll stop at Friday evening. Still some rain around. Uh, and as we get into Friday night and early Saturday, the heavy rain moves east. But notice there's still a little spin in the atmosphere Saturday at 8 a.m. And Saturday is a big day as far as kicking off the month of May for the city of Indianapolis. And we will include a couple of spotty showers. We talked about this last night for the mini marathon. Temperatures will be in the low to mid 50s. Maybe you're going to rev Saturday night if you're lucky and have tickets. Maybe a shower early in the evening. Then we start, should start to dry things out. Temperatures will be uh, in that range of 55 to 60. As we get into the upcoming weekend, still a chance for a lingering shower. As mentioned on Saturday, temperatures in the 60s. As we get into Sunday, Mother's Day, we start to clear things out and warm things up. 74 on Sunday afternoon. The real warm up gets here the early part of next week. Low to mid 80s Monday and Tuesday.